Today we're going to talk about creating a VLOOKUP function that returns an entire row of data with one single input of that function or formula. Probably what you're used to having to deal with when you have a VLOOKUP where you want to return a row of data is having to manually type the column reference dragging the formula to the right and then having to change that column every time you drag it which can be annoying well there's a way around that there's a more dynamic way to do that and rather than hard coding a manual number in for your column reference you can use the match function which can automatically adjust the column reference with your drag so in this example here we have a data set of loan account numbers and all the related loan information and what we'd like to do is enter an account number here and return the entire row of data from this data set for a given account number now one thing I do want to mention this method that I'm about to show you will only work if your output has the exact same headers as your data set that you're looking up in. So we'll get started here. So you'll do the VLOOKUP. Your lookup value will be, you know, the same as always. We have one cell where we want to type a lookup value in. I'm going to hit F4 to lock that down. Our table array is going to be this set of data over here. Also going to lock that down. Our column index is where we're going to insert the match function. So we have our lookup value. Our lookup value is going to be our column header. I'm going to hit F4 twice to lock just the row, but keep the column relative because we're going to drag this to the right, and we want it to move with our drag. Our lookup array is going to be just this first row of headers here, And finally, we want an exact match. And what the match does is it returns the relative position of a lookup value within an array. Well, our lookup value is what? This header here, loan account number. Where does it fall in this array? Well, it is the first cell in that array. So this will produce a match of 1 because match produces the relative position. So that is our column reference. We wanted to return the first column, and that's what the match will produce. Finally, we're back into our VLOOKUP function. We want false for an exact match. The numerical equivalent is zero. So I hit enter, and now when I drag this to the right, I do not have to adjust the columns. It will adjust automatically. All I need to do is fill without formatting because I already had these cells formatted and you can see it returns an entire row of data without having to manually adjust the column references in our VLOOKUP function. So just to kind of run through that again, you can see instead of a hard number for our column reference in the VLOOKUP, we have the match, which we're doing a match on our header here in this first row of data it is the third position in that first array of cells up there. So that is our column reference. It produces three and it's automatic. So that is how you can quickly create a VLOOKUP that returns an entire row of data. Thanks for watching, guys.